have not been created to walk alone in darkness, bear a broken heart, and weep alone in loneliness. We have not been created to put our gifts in boxes, admiring our treasures while they overtake our conscience. Raise your hand. I trust in God. 
I trust in His Word. I trust in God. I trust in His Word. I trust in God. I trust in His Word. You've been examples to me of the tremendous spirit, the Christian spirit, the Christian spirit of Jesus' love by the way you've given examples of reaching out to your brothers and sisters. You've taken this pandemic and you've risen above. You're, you've raised your hands up to God and say, God, what can I do? How can I be of help? How can I help my brothers and sisters? And I've watched and I've observed and I've seen, and it has taken my own spirit and helped me to rise above the difficulties that we have here and now and to look to the love that has saved us and redeemed us in his son, Jesus Christ. As we look to the future, we're going to need those hands. We're going to have to be the Lord's hands. We're going to have to be his mouth to profess his faith and to offer those prayers. We're going to have to be those individuals who are present, enacting Jesus' presence in a love towards our brothers and sisters who are in need. And I need your help. I need you to help us to accomplish what the Lord wants his church to be for others, his presence and his love. And I know with him, we will rise above. Let me offer to you and to your loved ones uh, my own apostolic blessing. The apostolic blessing is a blessing that is bestowed upon the, the bishop to be able to use because he is the successor of the apostles. As we enact our community in the name and the love of Jesus Christ, I offer you my blessing to you and to your loved ones. The Lord be with you. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Our help is in the name of the Lord. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit.